in the world of pets and animals, right? Now, you have a puppy that, well, it's a dog, but it's the size of a teacup. Looks so, like a puppy. Yeah, uh, that you love very much. Mm-hmm. Can you tell when Liza's in a bad mood oh. or if she's in a funk? I mean, she'll tell you. She, I mean, she'll stare me down and bark at me if I did something wrong. Yes. Well, uh, yes. evidently, our animals need more attention than just the mandatory walk. A new study says that dogs are getting depressed. And so, uh, well, we decided to uh, decided to find out a little bit more about how they can be addressed and, and cared for. This is Dog News. And now, your Dog News anchor, Annoying Pet Owner. What does a new study say? What's it say? <gasps> it says puppy whoopies get depressed. <gasps> do you have poor mental health? Yes, you do. Who's a sad boy? Do you need a Prozac? Yes. You keep chewing up the house all mopey whoopy. <laughs> Are you hoping I won't notice you hiding behind the car tire when I try to back up? Well, I notice you. You need to deal with your boo-boo feelings. Yes. <laughs> We're going to give you antidepressants and puppy therapy and... Got belly rubs. Who got a belly? Who got a belly? <laughs> yes, you do. You got a belly. Stay tuned for more dog news. I've seen people that are like the most tough, hardened, calloused, mean, bitter people sound just like that guy when they're with their pet. Like, who are you? Where did you come from? Well, you know, maybe if you acted like that all the time, they wouldn't get depressed. Maybe, but, you know, maybe, there you go. You need hey. a Prozac. <laughs>